Now, the, originally I had planned to just film a fe uh, cleaning day video. That was a few days ago. So the forest cobra footage in this video was filmed then, but today I'm just switching that video to the largest cobras that I have. So that's what this video is. The largest cobras I have. Subscribe if you're new. Love y'all. Hope you enjoy. Forest cobra. The largest of the true cobras. True cobras being those in the genus Naja. Now the king cobra is not in Naja. They are in their own monotypic genus, Ophiophagus. So although they're the longest venomous snake on earth, they're not the they're not true cobras. Forest cobras are notorious for being very difficult to handle. They're very quick, very agile. They're like mambas in cobra form. Twitchy, nervous, sometimes very defensive. This one is very twitchy and wiggly, but it, it typically resorts to trying to get away instead of defending itself, which can be better at times but also very, very difficult to deal with. If it's bolting and you reach and grab, then sometimes he does turn around and try to defend himself. The forest cobra. Awesome snake. Now there used to be only one, one species. Now there's five different species. Different species, not subspecies. Awesome. You ready for some more large cobras? How about these massive, this massive albino monocle cobra? Look at my hand shaking because of how heavy it is holding it this far back. Let me readjust. But look at the size of this massive albino monocle cobra. The largest one I've ever worked with. Incredible. I'm going to get the male out now. He's a little bit more on the defensive and wiggly side. She's very calm. Awesome. Here's the male. A lot more vocal you hear. And I'm sure you heard him when I had the female out. Now I'm separating them because I'm going to be feeding and with cobras, they have super high food response. It's a good way to get them bit or to bite each other, feeding them in the same enclosure. So I separate the elapids that are paired and feed separately. And then after a couple days, well, usually a day or two, I put them back together. But how incredible is this? Albino monocle cobra. Now, since I'm sticking with the large cobras um, for this video, the next one is also going to be a monocle cobra. But these are the largest ones that I have. Awesome. So, like I said, another monocle cobra. This one's Lila. The iconic Lila. The best snake I have, personality-wise. She's just wonderful all around. Got her when she was like this long. Now look at her. She was the longest snake I had until I got the forest cobra and these massive albino monocle cobras. But she's incredible. Love her to death. Now I hope you enjoyed this video. And yeah, leave some video suggestions if you have some. Love you all. I'll be back soon. Subscribe if you're new. Take care, everyone. Love y'all.